Today I'll show you my secret to perfect green bean casserole. This video also features two bonus recipes, delicious saute mushroom with marsala wine, and a clever hack for perfectly baked buttermilk biscuits. Whether you are preparing for a holiday feast or just want to upgrade your weeknight dinner, stay tuned as these recipes are for sure to impress. Open two cans of green beans, drain them, open a can of cream of mushrooms and pour into a mixing bowl. Add half cup low sodium chicken broth to the can and stir to get the rest of the cream of mushrooms. Pour into the mixing bowl. Add 1 fourth cup heavy cream, half teaspoon each garlic powder and onion powder, and 1 teaspoon chicken powder to the same bowl. Stir and add green beans. Add black pepper and 2 pinches of salt. Stir until combined. Pour onto an 8x8 dish and put in a 350 degrees oven and bake for about 25 minutes until bubbly. While it's baking, let's discuss about the crispy shallots. Here I have a regular fried onion that I purchased and I have fried crispy shallots that I made. You can tell the difference between the two. On the right is the store-bought fried onion and on the left is the homemade crispy fried shallots. I posted the recipe before, also available if you click on the exclamation mark on the top right corner of this video. Because they are shallots and not onions, they will add additional flavor. Take out your green bean casserole from the oven, stir, and bake another 5 to 10 minutes. Take it out the second time from the oven and spread 1 half cups fried shallots or onions and put back in the oven for 2 minutes. If you are using onion, do it for 5 minutes. This is what it looks like, creamy and flavorful. This green bean casserole and the bourbon cream corn are usually the first to go at my table. Thank you so much to everyone who has subscribed to my channel. Your support means so much to me. If you haven't yet, hit the subscribe button and turn on the ring notification for quick easy and delicious recipes, plus fun food reviews and travel eats. Next, we'll be making saute mushrooms. These are the ingredients plus shallots. Saute half cup sliced shallots with 2 tablespoons butter and 1 tablespoon olive oil. Add 16 ounce sliced mushrooms. Add 1 tablespoon chopped garlic. Add 2 teaspoon chicken powder. 2 tablespoon chicken broth. 3 tablespoon marsala wine and 3 tablespoon white wine. Continue cooking until the liquid is reduced. Add black pepper and salt and the mushrooms are ready. The third dish we are making is biscuits. This is the cheat version. 
These are buttermilk biscuits from Walmart from their frozen section. I have tried many frozen biscuits and so far these are the best. The instruction said to bake at 375 degrees. Don't follow that. First, we preheat our oven at 400 degrees. Then we buttered our pan. Add the frozen biscuits touching each other so they raise up more. Bake at 400 degrees for 20 to 25 minutes. Take them out from the oven and put some butter. I just used a stick of cold butter and the biscuits are ready. I hope you enjoy my video. Don't forget to like and comment. Thank you for watching and see you next time.